So I want to address a couple things. I'm back in Phoenix. I guess they're having some kind of Memorial Day parade tomorrow, downtown Phoenix. I'm going to try to go. Uh, I'll try to get video of it. Find out what's going on downtown Phoenix. I'm going to wear my Make America Great Again hat and carry my gun, you know, just self-defense. But anyway, I'm not going to say too much. But anyway, uh, I just want to address a couple things. I'm back in the Valley of the Sun, back in Phoenix. Uh, the extreme dread Ladna Rosinski war is still going on. It's ongoing conflict that I'm having the, like the last week with these two. I don't even know how it started, but it started somehow. But anyway, uh, I want to address a couple of things. Nitro Junkie, there's a name you haven't heard in a while. He's getting involved now. So they're saying that I'm schizophrenic because God talks to me. God talks to me every day. It's called the Holy Spirit. If you don't understand that, then, you know, I question your faith with God. Now, I'm not going to judge anybody's faith with God. What's going on between you and uh, the Lord and Savior upstairs? That's between you and the Lord and Savior? I can't question that. I'm trying to set my camera up. Something else away. Here we go. Let me explain something, Okay. There's this thing called the Holy Spirit. I talk, I talk to God every day. Nitro Junkie says, well, it makes you religious. No, I'm not religious. Jesus was against organized religion. Okay? Religion is evil. Religion is like Catholic, Mormon, uh, Islam, Satanism. Those are religions. Okay? If it doesn't come from God, then it is evil. It is bad. Okay? Jesus himself told us about, you know, organized religion. He told us through the Holy Bible. Religion is evil. I'm faithful to my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. I'm not religious. Absolutely not. It's called false prophecies. Jesus warned us about false prophecies. God speaks to us, yes. He speaks to us through Holy Spirit. He speaks to us through other people. I can't explain how God works. That I can't explain it. He does it. He speaks to me every day. It's not called schizophrenia. Rosie Alix said I'm schizophrenic because I believe that God talks to me. Here's what liberals I've heard of doing in the past trying to say that Christians suffer from schizophrenia because they believe God talks to them in their head. So they believe that we have voices in our head telling us to do things. And because of that, we are mentally ill. And because we're mentally ill, we should not own guns. So we're gonna, they're going to try to red flag us because I'm allegedly mentally ill because I suffer from schizophrenia because God talks to me. I'm not crazy, okay, like Sarah Connor in Terminator when she could see the future. When she thought she'd seen human machines or shit like that, you know? My name's not Sarah Connor, okay? Now, she wasn't crazy. She was realistic in the movie. The machines did take over, and they got another Terminator movie coming out. Number six, I think, seven? I don't know. I forgot. I lost track. It's called Dark Moon or Dark... I can't remember. Something. So anyway, I just want to explain that I'm going to stick to my godly principles. I am going to defend my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. I'm going to stick to the commandments, even though I screw up. But Jesus died for my sins, right? Um, I'm going to stick to my guns. I'm going, to st I'm going to stick to my guts. That's the way it is. You can call me mentally ill, schizophrenia, whatever. God talks to me every day. Okay? I'm not mentally ill. I don't suffer from schizophrenia. Yes, I hear voices in my head, and they come from God. My Lord and Savior in the heavens above. Okay? Now red flag me.